My food is important to me. You not important to me no more. You are fine. I'm a hustle bit hustle. Oh my well, you I'm know a old what? school you... G. Give me my I've been old school G all my life and I'm gonna be one to the day I die. If you can't accept it, get to stepping. And I mean that I take care of you. I take good care of you. I buy your house, you don't work, I pay your bills, I do everything. Old school G said, baby, yo, sis fired. I've been taking, I've been a hustler all my life. I'm an old school hustler. I've been taking care of you like, like you was my little girl. <laughs> Fellas, that's how you handle it when you catch him cheating, even though he went to some extremes through cheaters. You see the look on her face. She was petrified, right? She was petrified. So good buddy, good buddy was highly upset. He ran down his whole resume, you know, his history. He's an old school hustler, old school G. So, so, so good buddy. I hope you had some others on the team. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if that's your wife, if that was your girlfriend and things like that. But hey, man, as long as that check and pension keeps coming in, there's nothing to worry about. Fellas, you know, he could have said it in a more suave way. You know, he was all aggressive yelling. We don't need to do that with the ladies, fellas. Even if you do catch her, catch her cheating. But JR, we should be, we should be able to be emotional. Go ahead if you feel like doing that, if you must do it in that manner. But guys, there's nothing wrong with just letting her, you know, go on about her business. You could have just said you're fired. I mean, you got your own way of handling things. But as long as you know that you're that dude, I'm that dude. How dare you? You're fired. You go ahead and get a neck. You go ahead and get another one. The next one's coming. The next one is coming, fellas. You just got to have that confidence, man. Have that confidence to walk away, even though, you know, he went about different ways of doing it. You know, if you want to tell her a piece of your mind, by all means, tell her a piece of your mind. But it's better when you just leave her wondering. Because women have to wonder, guys. They have to wonder. You just up this, you know, you just up block her phone number. If y'all, especially if y'all not living together, you living together, that's a different story. You know what I mean? But you block her number, don't answer her calls. You know, if you were sending her a little allowance or a little stipend weekly, you cut that back. You know what I'm saying? Or you just cut back your time. And that's the quickest way to get somebody's attention is to remove yours. We heard that over and over and over and over and over. So my man, I understand he's from the old school. He probably used to going off. Maybe he had so much invested in her. He was paying her bills. Said he told her, baby, you ain't even got to work. And you got the nerve to mess around with this dude. Ladies, if you're going to mess around, at least mess around with some dude that's going to be able to take care of you. Maybe that might have been the issue. I know a lot of you guys going to be like, Jr. we didn't see the context of the video. Hey, I know the context was he was giving her the business there. That's all you need to know when he caught her cheating. You know, a lot of ladies will be like, well, you don't know what he did. Everybody says it's two sides of every story. But it's funny enough on these videos, you guys never say, you know, even though. I'm a, I'm a defender of men as well, but you guys never say what it is that uh what it is that the other party is doing in terms of that and vice versa. So, you know, we never know what he's doing. But fellas, if you must do it in style, do it in class. If you want to embarrass her, hey, that's your prerogative, man. But always keep it G, you know. And if you choose, which a lot of you guys didn't like when I say this, if you choose to hold it over her head and leverage it you know, to get her to do certain things, then do that too. I know a lot of you guys said I was giving bad advice, but I gave you guys a few options. You guys get highly upset on these things. I know you guys like checking out vids like this, man. So anyway, let me know what you think. I'm done talking about it, man. Let me know what you guys think about this video. And if you've ever been in a similar situation where you were kind of like on your, on your, on that sugar daddy time and things like that, let me know. Let me know how it went for you guys, man. Like, share, comment, and subscribe. Hit me up on Cali and Linktree to book that one-on-one -on -one with yours truly. Subscribe to my backup channel. If you haven't subscribed to this channel, man, hit that subscribe button. We're trying to run this up to 75000 before March 1st, man. I know we can do it. Let's do it, guys. Dating show is coming soon. It's going to be banging. Trust me. Make sure you guys purchase all of my books and merch like right now. I'm dropping new t-shirts every week. I know I got something that you like for the men and women. You know different designs, whatever. Pick them up now. That being said, man, this is wisdom. Peace be upon you all. The mercy and blessings of the almighty. And I'm going to catch you guys on the next one. I'm out of here. Peace. It's God.
house to beat me. And I don't know. I will put a light in the sky for the G's that done turn memory from God. 